Yes, guys. Hi, VOD viewers. Hi, VOD viewers. Hope you're having a good day. We're playing Legend of Zelda Sports Guard. Okay, we're gonna end the starting soon screen early. Uh, we might be dealing with a little bit of glitching, um, just because my phone is being funky again. Um, but we're playing sports. <laughs> okay. Sorry, it sounded quiet for a second. Hello, new friend. Sorry if you you left. Um, I know I I used the starting soon screen to uh grab this. Okay, I had I had to sit there for a second and remember that it said grabis like like grub like food. We're going straight into the puzzles. I moved which room I was in. Um, can you go in this one? Um, I don't think there's much I can do. I love the CDs in the background. Thank you. Uh, those, I think, were some of my first decorations that I put up. Um, in all honesty, I really like my Lemanberg flag one because I made that one oops, right as I tried to make a Lemanberg blanket. Oh, you I was wondering. 
You slept through last stream. You were so bummed you missed it. It wasn't an amazing stream, honestly. Um... Depends on which stream you're talking about. Friday stream was a little scuffy because B wasn't feeling the best. So we just kind of dealt with really bad internet and talked for like 15 minutes. There's like the VOD for Friday. I'm so, you're so upset you missed the gay little stories. It's it's okay. Let, oh. Luckily, there'll be more gay little stories, because tomorrow... Oh, wait. Tomorrow, I'm going to B's place to... <sighs> How am I supposed to get to that one? Uh, it's okay because we're gonna do. I'm gonna. I'm, or it's not streaming. It's for the podcast. But we're gonna do some gay stories for the podcast because every little every little guy in the podcast is gay, unless that. Oh shoot! Unless I say otherwise, because why not? It's the same reason- that's like the same thing with most of the characters, uh, when it comes to, like, neurodiversity. Hell yeah, gay little stories! And it's gonna be- we're gonna add a little bit of angst, because that is, angst is always good. No? Wait. Okay, I'm- what? Okay. That literally did nothing. At- at this point, I might as well- I don't- Speaking of your podcast right now, I'm halfway through episode 7! What happened to episode 7? I'm trying to remember. Oh! That's before we hit a bunch of those one-shots. I can't remember the exact reason why, uh, but I think someone got sick and had to cancel, and so there's like... Eight- There was only supposed- Hello, Soul Wolf Gamer! Welcome into chat, and thank you for the follow! Um... But episode 8.5... I- I hope you're having a good day, Soul Wolf. Um... We are puzzling, and the puzzles are hurting my brain again. I'm gonna move this dude. Um... We're gonna try that. We're gonna see if that works. Um... This might work. Hello? I- I played this on Twitch as well. The stamina bar in this game- IT DOES LOOK LIKE A LIME! I'm not the only- oh wait, the door's this way. That's like my entire life, I'm like, it looks like a little lime! Did you have a good time playing it as well, uh, Soul Wolf? It looks like a good lime, though. Like, it's the type of lime that if somebody said, Would you like to try this? I would say, sure. I would take... I would at least lick it. Sorry. I did. My controller caught on... Your controller caught on fire?! Oof. On this temple as well? Whoa. Okay. Hang on, guys. I'm figuring it out. Where? That's... Oh, wait. Wait. Oh! Oh! Guys, 
I did it! At least I think I did it! I'm not gonna be scared of my controllers for the rest of my life. Oh good, I thought they were gonna make me fight the boss again. We're so we're honestly close to the end. Um, there we go. Doorway. Oh, there's a little, a little smack smack. <laughs> Why did I smack that? I don't know. Scared of it. Yeah. Um. I've never had my. Yes, I know. Thank you, Fee. Um. Well, as long as you don't hear a tick sound and ignore it, like I did, you're fine, lol. I've only, like, destroyed a remote. I've been doing this an entire year now, and I honestly need to invest in some new Joy-Cons. Because my brothers- Because I play with Joy-Cons. I don't play with those other fancy remotes because they don't work for my brain very well. Beans! We're gonna throw beans at them. <sighs> when I was younger, I thought if you jumped on this too soon, it would like... Whoosh, because like, the stone looks super hot. My controller overheated and the battery split inside. Oh, That would make sense on how it got lit on fire. Oh, this is no good. Okay. Yeah, this is- that's what the tick sound was. How did you not- Never mind. I was about to ask how did you not feel your remotes heating up, but then I thought for a second and I went, if my remotes were heating up, I wouldn't question it that much. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. There we go. I'm gonna be more careful when grinding Mario Kart now. Fair enough. This dungeon used to give me a lot of problems when I was younger. But look at me, I haven't even fallen in the lava once! Anyways. Oh, spin time, it's spinning time! I was playing it at the time when it was really hot weather, so... I thought nothing of it. <laughs> give me the... Give me... No, no, oh, there we go. I only have a heart. Spin. Ooh, okay. Heap. Oh. Okay. Oh, does that unlock it above? That is a question. It does not unlock above. Oh. Beans. Jump. And then you gotta do with the bats, the keys. I'm gonna slap them. I'm gonna slap them with my sword like this. Oh. Oh, they oh, oh, oh. Why is there so much lava in Nintendo games? I don't know. I've never thought of it. Beans. Oh, beans. Come on. Beans. Beans. Uh-oh. No 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 I was so close I was so close I shouldn't have said anything about falling into lava There we go Um That is a good question Beans. Ah, uh, let me think. And maybe it's because it's a realistic thing in like the real world, but like not realistic enough. So it's like not a lot of people have gone and seen lava. And so if you're trying to make a fire based area, you would totally use lava because it's hot. Like hot people. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I say things? <laughs> okay. I feel like there's gonna be a bat. Or, well, there are keys, actually. Um... I'm missing important knowledge. Whatever shall I do? <laughs> yeah, that pops me up there. Uh... Oh, wait. I was doing... Why did it start the battle music? <gasps> oh my gosh! Okay, beans. I think three people yelled at, yelled at me at once because I sat on a chair doing nothing and typed to find what was... Oh, what was wrong with your controller? They kept broken ones just because it was funny. No! No! <laughs> what do I need to do? Nobody questioned me. I've played this game since I was nine. Uh, I had a story. There was a story. I, <laughs> I was in the bathroom before stream and I was like, There's, that's a good story. Not, it wasn't, it's not a bathroom story. But I was like, that's a good story. I should tell it on stream. Ooh, that was a little late. <sighs> Why do I react to that? Why can't I just jump with- I- I know you want to hear- you hear it, but I don't- I can't remember it now. I- it was a good story! All I- all I can remember right now is how my dog kept waking me up all night. Well, not all night. See, what happened? So there's this thing that happens when you're a little sleep deprived. Your brain just kind of makes you think everyone hates you, which honestly is oh, loopy. Um, which is honestly a pretty effective way to get your brain to like shut down. Um, is just like make you be emotional because eventually. I have a bunch of stories that I wish I could forget them. I can I oh I I can talk about all the bad ones. But not not the funny ones that would actually be great clips. Cuz that that's what I that's what I would f f f What? No with the frogs. Ooh. We don't like the frogs here. Frogs are annoying. IRL frogs are cool. But Zelda frogs, video game frogs, I have a few as well. Video ooh. Video game frogs we don't like. One time you fell in front of over 40,000 people. Oh! Guys, look! Wait, I wanted to actually... Last time I, I was in this area, I wanted to look around, but then I just immediately ran forward. So... The dark colored one with the monsters was... Power? Oh. Well, that doesn't tell me anything. That's not bad. I did that at that in school tripping up the stairs and I hit hard on the ground. I mean, 40,000 is a guess. It could be more, it could be less. Fair, bleh, bleh, fair enough. F 
everyone heard it? Uh, I think I, I don't think I have like any like embarrassed, like I've fallen in front of people. I mean, at Comic-Con, I painted myself blue and then rode on the tram. I think we have, we all have falling stories. Ooh, try for, oh, guys, I can skip it. Oh, the, the thing fell down. Uh, like, we destroyed part of the place, and now we're gonna go check on Zelda. I forgot what happened here. I broke my ankle on a blow up water slide. Had no pain and no one believed me. Oh, until you got an x-ray? I broke, no, I sprained my ankle. Okay. The way I've broken every single bone isn't even funny. I think I broke my foot by jumping, just whoop. It may have been his brain, I can't remember, but it hurt. And then I've broken both of my middle fingers. The first one, I was playing Leapfrog. And the second one, I just bapped it across the wall, on the wall. Broke almost exactly the same way. She's so pretty. I'm very lucky. I've never broken a bone. Good for you, Grubus. It's like, I think that's one thing. I think that might be my thing is I can't drink milk. Like I can't drink milk at all. I'm, I was allergic when I was a child and now I'm lactose intolerant. And so I'm not a huge fan of milk. I forgot I named him Bottle. Can we, boss, there's a boss battle, isn't there? To, like, I'm letting this cutscene play out because I don't remember entirely what happened here. But it's too fluffy. There's too much fluff going on. Allergic to milk? How do you live? Milk is so good. You learn to like vanilla almond milk and coconut milk. That reminds me of me getting hairline fractures on my thumbs. I- you did that on stream? I'm just a big- a big fan of dairy in general. Yeah. Um, what's crazy- what's wild about, um... Well, about my allergy was it wasn't like lac- Lactose or anything? Oh, they're talking. Uh, it was actually... It's Tumblr Twink! Sorry. <laughs> I can only drink lactose milk and processed milk. <gasps> He's got a little injury in his nose! What? What happened to you? I'm sorry, it's who? <laughs> so... The first time I fought Girahem, this is Girahem, by the way. He's a Tumblr Twink type of guy. Thank you, Soul Wolf Gamer. He is hot. Um, and I would like to preface that in a, I forget that hot means sexual because to me everything is aesthetic, and so I just say hot and is aesthetic. Um, but yeah, he he is a Tumblr Twink boy. And he's a sword. Like, that's just... That's just how it goes. I can't be the only one here who thinks he's not hot. <laughs> I, I, fictionally? Fictionally?
functionally and aesthetically, I like him. But when people say hot, they normally mean sexually. I am arrow ace. I don't understand that. So in the why is he dead? It's the 2010 emo hair for me. Stand down. <laughs> oh. You guys want to know some crazy lore? I think I've said this before on stream. But when I, when I was first getting into fan fiction, any what's what's worse? What's worse is my, my main type of fan fiction I would read for a long time is X Reader, and I still like it. It's still fan fiction I read to this day. But I read them on Wattpad. I need to play this in hero mode. Ugh, I... I think I have a save pro, pro... a save... for hero mode somewhere on the Switch, but I don't know if I... where it's at, and I don't want to... I don't want to try that. <laughs> Um, but, how do I remember so much about this fic? Okay, so it was an ex-reader, ex yearham but not, a, it wasn't a romantic one. It was, it was like, oh no, Impa, you tall, strong, beautiful woman, he hurt you. Um, it was like a sibling fic, but for some reason, this little girl went down to the surface and Gary Hammer was like, sure, whatever. <sighs> What's your favorite boss in this game? Probably Gearham. Like any of the Gearham, not this battle specifically. I hate this battle, but the first two battles. Besides Gearham, damn it. And, when, and I actually mean the Gearham battles. Um. Probably the one where you have to use the whip to destroy the the thing. Mm, that that made sense. Um, I hate every demise battle, but I would have to say probably the like mechanical. That kind of looks like a teapot. Um, and then you take the whip and you take its joints and you rip it apart and then you pick up its sword and you smack it with its own sword. I like that one. See, Gearham gets a little less aesthetic in this final battle only because his desire to please his master, like, intensifies and he's not as cool. He's not as, like, tall, lanky. And more like... I wasn't given enough tension as a child. <laughs> Okay, we can skip this now. Smack, smack, smack. Okay. Okay, there we go. I'm so sorry for the noises that will that will happen from this stream. Um, I don't do well in like big battles. What? I can't- I would- uh, You just described me. I'm not tall and lanky and I wasn't given enough attention as a child. I'm so sorry. I did not mean to offend. I mean it in like... An evil villain way. Stop making funky noises. Okay, there's a... Oh, did I do it? Hey! Yeah, I'm the evil villain. Oh my gosh, you have a boom! Ow! Wait, what am I supposed to do? No, 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 don't throw booms at me! I don't want your booms! Oh my gosh, turn around! I don't want their booms. 
If you want, if you wanted to do, okay. <laughs> this is the start of your villain origin story. You got, you got called, you got told you look a lot like Garham, who's a tall, lanky villain. Oh, oh no, oh no! <laughs> okay. Deep breaths. Hey. Hey. What a fun way to take out the little ones with bombs. No, that's great! Except for when they're running at me with the booms. Uh. And if you hit them, they explode! <laughs> okay, it's okay. Oh, too close. You want a f- Yeah, what a fun way. <laughs> oh! Oh, wait a second. It only ruins- It only takes one heart away from you. Oh no! Is the is the is the is the fat butt ones? Ow! Oh, that one's dead. Okay, that one's dead as well. Ow! Stop! 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 I like to hit them with a slingshot. Oh, because it stuns them. Normally, I I learned how like you can run over them. <laughs> okay, give me ah, give me your heart. Okay. No, it blows up. No, it blows up the boom. <sighs> okay, okay, this is fine. Ow! I find that very rude of you. here we can do side quests before we do the final battle or we can do the final battle and then the side quests this is <laughs> this is funny to watch oh oh there was a boom too close hey let's go hey hey <laughs> I another boom dude <laughs> um cuz like technically if we do the 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 side quest before I think I might have more hearts because I think I can like work on that We're not necessarily going for 100% here. We're just getting the side quests. I don't like the zombie book goblins either, which I think there's some of them in this battle, and I don't like that. I don't like them. Ow! Is it just... Oh. What? Oh, okay. Hey! Hey! Okay, that explains why there's just one. I'm the side quest, the main sto- <laughs> Then the main story type of person. Like when I'm when I play a game on my own, I will normally do hey 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 ah 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 I have no respect for you. Stop calling your little buddies in. I don't. <sighs> I'm gonna smack you. Where'd you go? Let me smack you. Where is he? Where is 
is he? Oh my gosh. Gosh. Oh my gosh. That was terrible. Ooh. The run away? What? <laughs> so I knew there wasn't much more after that dungeon. I have to ask how Chumpkin is doing. <laughs> I've never seen them run away. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that worked. Um, uh, so, uh, about Chumpkin, he's, he's outside right now. I, uh, come on. Hey! Bastard! Stop it! Jeez. Oh, I need that heart. The fat. Uh. Ooh, look at my shield. Uh. If you smack enough times, you can beat them with only going over their shield once. Oop, over. Smack, 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 smack. The face it made. <laughs> the face. The face made. <laughs> Something happened to Chumpkin. The dogs picked Chumpkin up and took him outside to the backyard. So he. So I need to, like, pick him up. Because while I was. While I was, um. Ow. While I was cleaning up dog poop today, I was like, I really should, um... I really should bring... I know, I'm sorry, Grubbis! Okay, so Chumpkin is this little cat pumpkin stuffed animal my brother got me. Um, and Grubbis named it Chumpkin. And, uh, it's outside. <laughs> See, he's not as attractive when he's all... I forget how to fight him! Uh, stab. Nope. Down? Oh, you gotta push him to the edge. Ow. Prick. Okay. <laughs> okay, now I see it. Yeah! No! No, stop! There we go. Ow. Guys, I remembered. Oh. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. He is hot now? See, to this, to, I, I, to me, this is, this doesn't really makes sense in my brain anymore. He's just, he's not, he, he doesn't have any of his cool features anymore. He's just metal. Like the sword he is. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> If I had to do smash or pass, you know what I'll pick. So you guys, you guys 
just went from being, uh, smack. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> smack. <laughs> stab, stab, stab. <laughs> right, you gotta stab him in his heart. Ow. My auto mod is a little... I don't know... What happens is like... Okay, there we go. Oh, oh no, no, no! Oh! Ooh. Ooh, oh! Where'd he go? Oh. Ow. Okay, give me a second. Don't be rude. What were you saying there? I'm not a boy. <gasps> oh. My brain didn't un <laughs> But yeah, you guys you guys went from being like like it doesn't really make sense why you would find this like slightly like mystical guy attractive and oh in any sort of way. Oh fu oh. Hello. What? And then, and then, and then, you now. I please remind you of Hero Brian. Okay, what am I doing wrong? But the minute he turns into his final form, you guys just, you. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. If I get to the final boss today, you guys are gonna think I'm pathetic. You like both forms? Maybe <laughs> I'm attracted to metal more than human. Okay, but his final speech here is very sad. Because he's like, every time we fight, I can't beat you. And then it's like, oh. And then what happens is he turns into a sword. Oh. And then what happens is we took too long to save Zelda because that's how games work. Don't don't make me fight him again. Is it just his toes? I hate these demise battles so much. I would hope you are kidding, Gr Grubbis. Goodness. <laughs> Ah, the bad guys powering up. See, look, he has a smile back. <laughs> you need to go do laundry. <laughs> Come on, but the big bad judge. Oh no, I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm. I'm. Oh 
I'm gonna smack his forehead. Have fun with laundry. Master. Looks like a dragon. Oh. Oh yeah, I was kidding. <laughs> But <laughs> he's not. I know how the battle goes, but it's like, what? That's why. That's why I'm walking away. <laughs> Gr Grubbis, what did you do? <laughs> Grubbis! No! Stop! You're hurting him. I had no intent to alarm. <laughs> Aww. I watched Wally the other day. And every time I watch Wally, I get a little bit of nostalgia because Wally is the movie that I've watched since I was a child. Um, like, even to this day, it's one of my favorite movies. But, like, it's... Wally! Um, oh, don't talk to me. I think you're funky. And I don't like you. I'm going to put my sword through your forehead. Don't you dare touch her. And God is knowing herself to me immortal. Hey! Let's go, Groose! Wally gets me to <laughs> gets me to cry faster than up. I think up has the advantage on making me cry faster because they have that entire like montage of him falling in love with Ellie and then Ellie dying that and then the like all of that. I think they it has the fastest speed run. But Wally um Wally's well, just comforting, and it's always been an and when I when you when you're looking at Wally as an like oh my god I'm gonna cry. Don't think about how when she goes to the doctor she was really hoping to have a baby, and then when she goes to the doctor she finds out that she can never have a baby, and then she cries because dang that's sad. And think about all that work they put into their house to make that, like, nursery for said baby, and now there's not gonna be anyone there. <laughs> the old girl says it'll take time to grease wide to absorb Zelda's soul completely. <laughs> Don't remind you! Cries. Or, or don't, don't think about how their entire dream was to go to Paradise Falls and they tried to save up, but life got in their way. But once they finally saved up enough, he was going to surprise her in the same way that they have been spending time together for years. But she falls on the way up and has to be hospitalized. And she dies in the cold, lonely ho place that is a hospital, because I hate hospitals and they're cold and lonely. Trust me, I can make this stream a real bummer for both of us. Through trauma? Like, like if, you're, if you're saying you can make it a bummer for both of us by bringing up trauma, I think we could both do that. Now I have to go... I don't want to do the side quest, but there's still over an hour for this stream. <laughs> okay, I'm skipping it now. Ooh, what's this? Rock! I'm not gonna trauma- trauma jump through a Twitch chat, don't worry. Okay. Fly! Fly! Oh, did I ha- wait, where am I? 
if you go backwards slightly. That bush looked invisible until I ran up to it. I think I'm supposed to talk. No? Maybe? Oh, that's right. You have. I have. There's so much that you have to do because you have to go through here and then go through there and then back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. <sighs> you know, just thought of something. Like, if the entire world was destroyed, then how would we be able to come back? Oh. Wait, where's the bird? Bird's sealed ground? Bird, 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 bird. What's your favorite song right now? I've been listening... My thing's in the way. To more music recently. Ooh, let me think. Bird, 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 bird. She by Doty. I think about Earth all... Earth being destroyed all of the time. Why do you think Wally's my favorite movie? Some say I think about it too much. Bird, 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 bird. But my favorite song right now is She by Dodie because it makes me cry because it's so sapphic and it's so nice. Okay, back up to the surface. I'll have to listen to that. It's a good song. I think the other ones that have been in repeat are basically... Any Oh Hello slash Korean Wives songs, because pretty much every character playlist I listen to is full of those songs, and I don't... I don't think that's bad. Uh, we fell in love in October. Um... And then that one girl in red song that goes I'm trying to remember how it goes hey. <laughs> the one that talks about button up shirts <laughs> okay if I remember correctly this boss... Do I have a wooden shield in here? I do. So... The thing about... I've been listening to a lot of Phoebe Bridgers right now. I'm a sad little baby. Can I help you? What do you... Do 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 do. Where'd he go? Uh, I think I know where he went. Talk to me, old man! We're gonna get drinks with this dude. The only Phoebe Bridger song that I... Okay. Uh, did she do one... With... I know there's the cover of that Bo Burnham song, and every time I listen to her cover, I cry because it's sad. Two of these, one of the pink one. Um, it's... Is it Boy Genius? Is Boy Genius? It might be Boy Genius. Someone mentioned... I was w watching TikTok the other day, and somebody said that Ed Sheeran... Not Ed Sheeran. Oh, no, not Ed Sheeran. Noah Khan. Um... Is like the Avengers of the folk music, like because he's just he got Mufford and Sons the other day, I believe, and it was like whoa, like he just keeps pulling everyone on stage, and I keep seeing clips. You know what I'm angry about? I'm not that angry about it, but the other day, I 
checked when the near like when's the closest Hozier concert. It's like I get told I look a lot like Ed Sheeran all the time, so hearing his name hurts. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, friend. Um But I looked up when Hozier is coming to Oregon, and it's like, what's today's date? The 25th? And tickets are like $100 per ticket. That's not counting, like, the gas to get there, and then the food that's inevitably, that we're inevitably gonna need, because that's just how it goes. Plus any, like, accessibility items we're gonna have to bring or buy. So, I'm not going, um... I think if you break her things, you have to pay for it, and I really don't want to pay for it right now. Because I'm trying to save money for that extra... Okay. What did you need? So, uh, I mean, what do you think I'm gonna be gross? Yeah, yeah. Well, I get tired of having a smiley shopkeeper. Night market. Buy and sell treasures, which we'll sell. I have earring 18. I'll sell you five. What weapon do you think would be best in the zombie apocalypse? Best in the zombie apocalypse. I almost answered sword because swords are cool, but... I think probably something long range. So if you're asking if I'm able to serve, like... If I can fight, I would say probably a bow and arrow because I have some practice with that. I hate this side quest so badly. It upsets me. And makes me feel like a bad friend to Pippin. Me and my- okay, so me and my brother would spend days- Wait. And we just- She makes- she would make funny noises. I'm saying baseball bat is the best. I guess. That's if you're- you're willing to get up close to them, cause- it also depends, are they fast or slow zombies? And can they climb? Because all of those are very important facts. Like, if... If we're trying- if it's- if they're slow, then yeah, I'd probably go with a bow and arrow because then I'd have time to set up in a higher area. But if they're fast, then I'll probably go for a melee weapon. I'm thinking... Zombieland zombies? I've never seen Zombieland. Over here. I like how you can break all of her dishes. My... Okay, so literally all of my joints have been hurting the last couple of days. I think it's because I overdid it doing chores the other day. Oh damn, it's a really good movie. Oh, yeah, maybe I'll keep an eye out for it. Um... Did you know that if you don't pick up your money from this quest, um... Mm, nope, that's the wrong one. I'm looking for the Seer's house, which I think is like... Gondo Scrap Shop. Ah, it's back here. Hey, slime! Pumpkin. Then you- then the- then the quest doesn't complete. I'm sorry, that was an incomplete sentence. I got new glasses! 
yet. I know. Do you play Stardew Valley? Oh, shit. Oh, uh, yeah, I do play Stardew Valley. Uh, the first first bachelor I ever married in game was, um... Gosh, why are names escaping me today? And I really don't want to describe him by his bad, uh, his toxic traits. But yes, I do play Stardew Valley. Big fan of Stardew Valley, it's a good one. Uh... No, it, it was not Sebastian. It was it was Shane. <laughs> and then and then my second playthrough, I almost married Elliot. It it was Shane. It was my second playthrough. I almost married Elliot, but then he took me out on a boat. And so I had to ask, yeah, you're gonna have to go. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Listen, if you think about it this way, at the time, I didn't understand that, that woman. I marry Mario every time. I think I might... Next time I play through and actually want to put effort into a, a like a bachelor or a bachelorette, I might go with Haley because I don't know. I well, I haven't list, like done her story at all. Um, she seems interesting to me, but let me defend myself in my bad choices of bachelors. I'm in it for the story, not for the romance. And so, like, a little bit of, like, I have emotional issues, but I'm trying to get better for my niece. Like, that's cool. But but then... Uh, I'm, I'm not a romance person. Who else have I forgotten to do quests for? Like, everyone in this game I've forgotten quests, but that's okay. Ah, shit, you know what I need? I play a woman in every game I can, and I keep getting told I'm trans, but like, am I? And like, I am, but they don't have to know that. What are your pronouns? I must know now. For I don't want to accidentally use the wrong ones in the future. I go by any with a preference for Zay and Zay Zem, but I don't care. I like neo pronouns, Zay Zem, all of all of the. Duty or job, and then he denies that he's doing it as a job. Um. Oh, I fell. Oh no! Whatever shall I do? Oh, I also need to upgrade this shield. They, she. I would put them on TikTok, but but I know IRL people. I know IRL follow me and on there, and I'm scared. That's the same reason I don't have my pronouns on my TikTok. Uh, in a couple of months, when I turn when when is my birthday, I plan on just not caring anymore because. I'll, I will be in charge of all my legal stuff, so like, oh well. Uh, but that's that's the exact same reason why I don't have my pronouns on. If not, I would because I like my pronouns. They make me. F okay. Uh, I'm trying to remember which quests I haven't done. Uh, hello? <laughs> bugs? You can sell bugs. Bugs, 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 bugs. 
Bugs, bugs, bugs. Bugs, 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 bugs. We're gonna sell him. What do you have? I have 20. I'll sell you five of them. The bugs are not worth their price. Like, I guess if I needed to make money, I could probably farm them, but I'm not a huge fan. Bite, bite, bite. What are you doing in here? Talk, talk, talk. Get out of Groose's room. I'm gonna sleep in this bed. I like this about that, this game, that you can just sleep in any bed. And the way he flops down, very satisfying. <laughs> Coming out to someone through stream when I haven't come out to to most people IRL is really weird to me. Interesting. Uh, for me, I've always felt safer coming out over the internet. Like, I had my first true, like, gender euphoria moment in the Discord because somebody used Zayzum for me. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. It How are you? <laughs> but yeah, I like when it comes to IRL, it's so scary. Damn, I'll have that one day. I'm sure you will. Like when I when somebody hopefully uses them in IRL, my pronouns IRL, I think I'm also going to have like a moment where it's just amazing. But for now, oh no, give that back. For now, the internet's nice. What? Okay, yeah. Someone in the restroom. My joints hurt. And I'm not happy about it. Joint problems. Do 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 do. So I think I'm just kind of like unofficial. Oh, yeah, sorry. I, uh. Yeah, I did that. Sorry. Okay. My. Uh, so the theme to the Knights Academy, I think I've claimed as the song that I use for all of my stuff. Hey! <clears throat> We're gonna see if we can upgrade this shield. Because the main thing about it is I'm highly certain that he uses electricity in the final battle and electricity is a pain in my ass okay can we upgrade again tumbleweeds okay it's fine it's always tumbleweeds I was on your Instagram and I saw your story of playing the guitar. It was it was so good. Thank you so much. Thank you. I yesterday I practiced again. I like practicing it. Talk to me. Oh. Wow. I am so far away from this side qu side quest that I haven't even fully started side quest shit. Uh. 
Uh, I'm trying to reset the day. See if finishing up that quest. My hair is touching like right here on my eyebrow and it's being a pain in my ass. Hey. I'm getting an electric guitar soon. My brother got an acoustic like six years ago and I'd love to play it. It's just not the kind of music I listen to. Interesting. That's ca that's cool. Uh, there's a lot of swimming and there's not a lot of swimming. I uh. Okay, that's fine. <coughs> Try not. Ow. Ba -ba -ba. And look at how long this tunnel is. It's a long tunnel. It's a long little dude. So long. Ow. So long. Very long. It's so cold right now. <coughs> Apologies. That's... How do I explain this? So, I don't like heat. Like, it, it, I'm sensitive to the heat is just how things work with me. Is I'm super sensitive to the heat, but the rest of my family is cold sensitive. And so my window, fully open. It helps that we got new windows, so it's a lot colder. Um. Okay. Let's head to the Lumpy Pumpkin. Nope, the Lumpy Pumpkin has quest way later. It's not Linnea or Desert that has it, it's this one. Um, but we have a wood stove and it makes it really hot in my house. Yeah, I love the cold too. I love the snow and everything winter. I love fall particular particularly. Ooh, there you go. Temple entrance. How? I have the so because I have joint problems, I have jaw problems, and I unhinge my jaw all the time. I'm complaining a lot about my joint problems today, but probably because it hurts, and uh, that's almost nat a natural response to things hurting. Mm. I mean, complaining is fun. It is. I like complaining about things that have a reasonable answer, but you just don't want to. Because it's fun. I love to complain. Link always just like this, which is like his like a uh, guard stance whenever this little robot talks to him because this little robot insults him mostly for being short. Oh, there's still one here. Okay. We're going to try and grab it. Oh, please stop. Oh, it's over there. Oh, I know where it's at. I call it... Call it winding... Wind... Winding... Sometimes in England? Interesting. Interesting. Where am, I know where I'm going. I don't know why I was pretending not to know where I was going. Yeah, it's definitely this way. See, there's this one that's kind of hard to get because you have to, like... 
time it correctly. Oh, I don't know. Oh, I see it. There's one there. Okay. We're gonna try to get both of those blocks. The other one... I totally thought there was only one left in this area. So we're gonna try to grab this one over here. Nope. Oh. Wait, I definitely should go for this one first then. Actually. Oh, I forgot to say I've been talking to some people. I'm DMing and gaming a couple of days. Let's go. That's so exciting. You should be exciting. Excited. That's ex that that really is exciting. I'm so glad for you. Okay, the butterflies don't like me. Ooh, rock. I got a rock. I like rocks. Oh, sword squad time. Sword squad strike. Boom. Still stuck on which campaign to run because I have so many written ones and none of them have been tested. I th I'm no help in this because I t am the type of person to totally just go with it. I don't plan a lot. I like I think I've said before, I don't do one shots very well. I, um, and the planning I do is like half a page, which leads to a lot of like my players not doing a lot or doing too much. I don't know. I think as long as you can roll with the punches, anything would be good. Because that's the biggest thing about Doom. It's, it's, it's also... Mm, I don't want to scare you. <laughs> it's also a little scary DMing. <laughs> but the, the more you do it, the more relaxed you get with it. Okay. Okay, so I need to be flying... This way! Nope, nope. Oh, okay. No! You're serious! Okay, how, I need... Let me out. No! Let me out! Do you have a shortcut to the top? Mm. You know what I'm... What I'm going to say... It... I'm going... I'm good at doing one-shots. Yeah! Guys, there is a shortcut. Good. So I can fall as many times as I need. Okay, goal here, aim this way. Ooh, sorry, I hit the mic there. With my elbow. It's a rock! It's not a boulder. It's a rock. Sword Squirt Strike. All of these will give us advantage in the final battle. Which is what I would like. We're gonna... Ow. I don't think there's any reason to head back to the neighbor desert. If there was, if there, oh, I think there is, because I should check. <sighs> okay, yeah. I think I've gotten all of them from this area. Where's the closest bird? That's the closest bird. Bird, 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 bird. Gillian Todd, Charter, champion of the undersea here, the deep. 
the one. Sorry. <laughs> bird, 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 bird. Again, there was such a good story I had. I wonder if I can think of it. I cleaned my room today. I cleaned my room today. And when it when it comes to cleaning my room, it's mostly picking up. I don't get any of your references. I burned down my first school today. He didn't burn down the entire school. The fire damage was limited to a couple of classrooms. I'll do better next time. Um. But I cleaned my room today! Because it's mostly just laundry and putting... Mm, oh, I need to be... <laughs> I knew you would get that one. That's why I did it. It makes... I like that one. Uh, mixed up mascot kid who doesn't know who he is. Oh, I landed on the wrong side. It's okay, it's not too far. Uh, normal oak. Uh, the chippy cheery... Chipper Cheery Perky Peppy School Spirit Mascot Kid. Lingley Lee Wilson, the school at home soccer kid. Uh the school in prit uh Lincoln Lincoln Kicks School in Prison. <laughs> As a homeschooler, it's the the school in prison is kinda funny because Lincoln M kicks. Sorry, Lincoln M kicks. School, schooled in, pr schooled in. Link, Link, Link. <laughs> Lincoln M kicks. <So> school, <laughs> bo Link, Lincoln M. Bo it's boss. Oh wait, I thought his title is boss. Uh, okay, so. I'm in a roleplay server for Dungeons and Daddies, and it makes me- and it's a lot of fun. I really like it. Um... Uh, but, like, I keep forgetting that certain characters are not amazing characters. Cuz, I really like the Oak Twins. Oh yeah, but Boss Kicks is far funnier. It is. But I keep forgetting how terrible the Oak Twins were to Normal and Hero. And like, I love Normal and Hero so much. I love both of them so much. <sighs> and so... Like, I've just been do playing with the Oak Twins, but like... Before everything happened to them? But... So after season one, but before season two starts. But then I'm attached to this version of them instead of the actual version, because Lark and Sparrow are bad parents. I love them. I love them as characters. They're so interesting. Um, but as parents, I hate them. They're so bad. Like, like, Lark straight up, not like Sparrow, gosh. Like, Sparrow, like, ah, oh, He hurts. It hurt me, man. Neuralok is the most relatable. I just have to say Anthony is way too good at playing abusive parents. Well, okay, like, every DM has their, like, Stop, like, what is your main type of villain? Uh, with, like, Brendan Lee Mul Mulligan's villains, it's capitalism. Um. Uh, with, uh, Anthony Birch, it's abusive parents. Uh. Oh, okay, that's fine. I can answer that one later. Um, my goal is for mine to also be capitalism. My goal is to make one of my players cry one day. I did that. <laughs> I will tell you right now, it is one of the greatest feelings ever. I, I, I won't spoil it, but I did get 
Jonas to cry on stream. Not on stream, on podcast. Oh. Where is it? Oh my god, I'm so je- I- my- so jealous. My S's are falling apart on me. Okay, which way do I need to go for this? It... Ooh, what? Okay. I've been told before I'm very good at fake anger. I, that's one thing I don't think I'm good at is fake anger. I'm good at the other emotions. I'm not good at fake anger. I think it's because I, in real life, I spend a lot of my time understanding my other emotions, but not anger. I spend no time trying to figure out my anger. <laughs> okay, keep going this way. What? I think I'm getting multiple at once. Come on. Okay, I might have to check my phone because I keep getting multiple texts from B. I'm certain it's B, because I saw their profile picture. Oh, I think... I think pool slide day may have happened. I don't know. Uh, Where am I going? This way. I'm going this way. I used to practice acting so I could be in a movie, so I use I use it to DM. Okay, there's one back this way. I feel like a lot of people wanted to be wanted to act because that's what I wanted to do as a child. It makes more sense now uh, that I know what I know about myself. Uh, why why I liked acting because I didn't have to be myself. I could be the character instead. Um But like even I I d is this a good job right now? No, not necessarily because it doesn't support me in any way, but I like calling this my job because it makes me happy cuz this is what I want to do. Uh and if you told 2020 me uh, and even younger, if you told, like... Oops. Why did that happen? Hello. Hello, darlings. Like, I feel like if you told, like, nine-year-old me, I just love movies and TVs, I write shows all the time, it makes me happy. Okay, we're gonna hop down this hole. Where is it? If, if I ever get a show made, I'll put it in the special thanks se I'll put you in the special thanks section. That's a promise. Oh, thank you. We're gonna, we're gonna look something up here. 
I'm going... Um... The, these are the, uh, goddess stones? No. Uh, we're gonna call them the goddess squares. You're gonna cheat at the game, you cheater. It's only goddess square... Farron Woods. <sighs> because... Goddess cube. It's called a goddess cube. <sighs> Where's that one? Okay, I know where that. I've gotten that one. Hang on. I think I've gotten that one. I've gotten that one. Oh, wait a second. Okay. Have I gotten that one? I don't know if I've gotten that one. We're about to see. It requires us to go up. Okay. This way. <laughs> Ooh. I have to run everywhere in this game. It's currently 3.40 a.m. and I'm watching the stream and I wonder why I'm so sleep deprived. You should probably go use the sleep. Using the sleep is a good idea. But I get it if you don't want to use the sleep. The sleep is not always what everyone wants. Max, 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 max. So, one of the biggest things when it, when it came to our content... It, um, but it's worth it. I'm glad it is worth it. Uh, when we were, like, figuring out what our timing for stream, because I like streaming at night, because it just is a lot less stressful for me. Um. Okay, there's one up there. Maybe it's this one. Oh, we're gonna try this one. We're about to see. Oh, jeez. Okay. Stream's probably lagging out pretty hard right now, isn't it? We're gonna see if this... Uh, we were talking about who... What... Who, ooh, which one... Who, like, who would be the viewers for these streams? Because it's like... P like, my time is Peace in the Forest best content creator. Thank you so much. I said I would I would pull the insomniacs into stream. <laughs> I got kicked, but I'm back. Okay, good. I do apologize for that. Because my phone is my internet, if I'm not paying attention, sometimes I will, like... Ow. Probably should have gone for that bubble back there, but that's fine. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I went in the wrong way. <gasps> I think my brain, oh, my brain's starting to lag. But that's okay. I hope you saw my best content creator message. I did, and I appreciate it so much. Like, you have no clue how amazing that is. It says there's a bird. Oh. Ooh, stop! Yeah. Exploded. Bird. 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 
Fly! There we go. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Okay. <sighs> oh, I did it. Okay. There's a chest up here I never unlocked. Smack, smack, smack. Smack, smack a room. Uh. I've done. What have I done this week? Every time I'm on stream, my memory just doesn't work amazing, and I don't, and I don't understand why. I have an amazing memory. Uh, I have medication for my memory. <laughs> I mean, technically, my ADHD med medication mostly helps with my memory out of most things. Um... When I was looking at Dean Dad's hashtag, I expected to find someone on the internet I would interact with more than one comment. Well, I'm glad that you are able to interact. Uh. Ah! There we go. It's this way more. Well, I'm glad you were able to have interaction. I know that's the biggest thing when it comes to, like, Twitch streams, is being able to, like, have conversations. Uh-uh. I know I like hanging out in some small chats sometimes for that exact reason. I haven't watched a lot of Twitch recently. I've been in a music mode. I think I go through moods for a lot for a while. I'll listen to like a podcast and then I'll listen to music and then I'll w watch a bunch of streamers. Um and then I'll circle back around to podcasts. Oh, come on. Where is it? Is this it? There it is. That took me forever. And then there's one... You're really the only streamer I have ever consistently watched. Well, I appreciate it. Like, a lot. We're, oh, like, we're close to hitting the one year uh, mark of our stream. And... Like, th it's exciting to me. Because I remember, like, halfway through or quarter way through, I was like... Wow, this, like, being a streamer, like, this year's gone quick. And, like, when I look back on it, I'm like, wow, it's, it's, it's weird. Like, the fact that I've, almost for an entire year now, have been doing this. And I'm getting to, like, this point in content creation where it's actually starting to work. <laughs> that sounds... Like, that doesn't make a lot of sense, I don't think. But I feel like when it comes to content on the internet, if you do it long enough, you're f like, the algorithm notice that will notice that for a certain amount of time you have existed in this space making content. Because that's normally what happens is it takes a streamer one to two years before they start getting active viewership. And it, to me, that makes sense because it takes a while to actually build content. There's been a few days I missed it, but I've worked really hard to do daily TikTok uploads. And when I mean daily TikTok uploads, I mean one TikTok for the time that I've been awake. So it's like, if I go to bed at 1 a.m., that's still the same day for me. <laughs> Ooh. 
I'm sorry. I don't, I'm not here to interact. Thank you. Let me go around. Thank you. Ugh, icky. It makes sense. I was saying something and it was going so well in my brain because I like talking about content creation because content creation is what I've like officially labeled as my special interest um, because there's just so many things that can fit into content creation. For example, because I say sp content creation is my special interest, what also lies in content creation is watching streamers. Um, so my hyperfixation will lean into streamers. Video games are also a very important part of content creation. Am I supposed to be up here? Ah, hello. Uh, video games podcasts. That one is also... Haha, <laughs> I was just talking about me DMing and I got a message saying it's cancelled. Blah. I'm so sorry. Oh, like, honestly, that sucks. Every time that, like, I'll have a player cancel on me, it is a terrible feeling. Uh, ooh, sorry, big run. Like, all hope is destroyed. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm sure you guys will be able to reschedule. Um, I think you probably will make an amazing DM. My glasses are new and they're creaky when I touch them. Okay, we're gonna take... Mm. <sighs> no, it's good. I'm sure I'll find another, some other group to DM for. <gasps> Sorry. I thought I made a connection, but I don't think I did. It's not that they couldn't make it. It's that they found a... They ditched you?! That's very rude. But they didn't even give you a chance. I'm outraged on your behalf. That sucks. Oh. <laughs> that sounds so sad. <laughs> you, you weren't kicked to the curb. They just don't think... Oh, wait. Mm. They just think they're better than you, even though... You were literally going to do a story entirely for them, and they decided not to. <laughs> I, ha I had to be careful. Oh, I need that. I need that. Where did it go? Basically, the entire time we're walking to our destination, I need to have this out. What is up there? I don't know how to get to it. We're looking for tumbleweeds. Oh, there it is. Tumbleweeds. Hmm. Rude. Excuse me. Thank you. What is back there? <laughs> what has been your best experience DMing? Recently, um... Recently we did a very... Very good episode, and... It was, it was barely planned. Um... The question sounds like we're doing a teen talk. <laughs> uh, welcome, welcome. 
uh, today's... Oh wait, I've never listened to a teen talk. I've never listened to a teen talk. The question... Yeah. Uh, I've, ne I've, I've never listened to a teen talk because I'm broke and I refuse to buy into things. Uh, hang on. What? They're great! I don't have Patreon! If I had Patreon, I would, but I don't have Patreon. I don't want to pay for Patreon right now. And I think it's going to be a good couple of years before I actually ha can, like, technically afford it. So... Instead, I get... I get... I get stuck in an off-brand Dungeons and Daddies Discord server. Um, when, like, half of my friends are in the main one. So... Like, sometimes someone will mention something, and I'm just like, that's from the main server, and they're like, yeah, and I'm like, I'm broke, and they're like, yes, you are. And then I call them rude names, because that's what you do. <laughs> oh, come on, I hate electric creatures in this game so much. Oh my gosh, there's another one. <laughs> There we go. Ba ba ba. Ooh, good. Honestly, I was hoping to find a piece of heart. <laughs> when, you, when it's said like that, it sounds terrible. Uh, but, oh, about that question about DMing. We had, it was an amazing session. M all of my players were really into their characters, except for B, because B wasn't there. I had to call B in. Uh, I also learned that the only, I only have one player that honestly likes, like, more chaotic sessions, more, like, lighthearted fun sessions, and everyone else prefers angst. Like, I was like, guys, do you prefer angst or, like, funny haha? -ha? And everyone but Jonas was, like, angst, and I'm like, really? Because I thought everyone was a funny haha. -ha. Okay, there's one over there. <laughs> I'm a big fan of angst. Well, you're gonna get some angst in the future. Can I, like... No! <laughs> I needed that tumbleweed. The angst definitely goes up a little bit. My favorite episodes of D and Dads is the ones that make me cry. I cried in like... I don't remember which... I think it's episode 5 where they go to the dance. And where... Where uh, Sparrow is just a terrible father to normal. I cried in that one. Because... After that, I, like, spewed an entire, like, paragraph's worth of words just out into the world. Which made me realize <laughs> I had problems. Um, it's quite hard to make me cry. I don't cry a lot. The fact that a podcast did is so surprising. Interesting. Where am I going? This is where I'm going. I'm going this way now. Oh, uh... I have cried to one episode in season one, and I'm sure you know which one is that. Is it- is it the cowboy? 
um, the cow, the... When you turn right at the, at the, at the, at the cowboy off of that, is, is it that one? I, I, I think it might be that one. If, if you ever, if you, yeah, it's the car, it's the cardboard cowboy. <laughs> when you go back and listen to season one, everything about Ron is so much sadder when you actually have the context. Like, instead of it just being a, oh, it's just Ron being Ron, it, you're more like, That's a trauma response! And it is- it's so sad to me. Also, in like... The fir oh, the first time, he hides his emotions in his pants, but he loses his pants! He loses his pants! Oh shit, I know! He loses his pants! Uh... But in like, the, f the first time that they meet... I hear dogs. I do apologize. They're barking. That's Opal. The one you can really hear is gonna be Opal. Mm. Okay. I, I see. This way. Oh, come on. She's a big, uh... Golden Retriever, uh, Great Pyrenees mix. Golden Retriever? I think she's Golden Retriever. Or she's Lab. I don't remember right now. She's... She's Great Pyrenees. So she's big. She's big dog. But like, I'm sorry. Every time I try to remember, I always fail. Um, when they first meet the cloaked figure, that they, they wake up, and you want to know what they said? You want to know what they said? You want to know what Ron said? Yeah, that's my... It was, everyone was like, yeah, it was Ron's dad. And Ron was like, yeah, it was my dad in his purple uh, bathrobe. No. There are a hundred different ways that that you've been listening to season one again oh yeah you have been yeah it, it honestly that's the coolest thing about DD podcasts well DD in general DD in general is you somehow foreshadow like the entire event it's crazy that they predicted it that exactly that's the coolest thing about D&D &D is, even though it's all made up and the DM really doesn't have that much of the story fleshed out when you start, I was like, three episodes in, exactly! Ooh. To me, that's one of the biggest things about D&D &D is you foreshadow everything before you can even, like, think. Because then you go back and you're like, huh. Oh, wait a second. Also, could I tell you something Anthony said in Teen Talk? I don't know. Was it said in confidence? No, go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. It's still on the internet. <laughs> One of the biggest things that I want to do some... Oh, oh are we having to head to this island? Ooh, it's a frog. Uh, wrong button. Why? Why did why why does Grant shoot Terry Jr.
So that wasn't planned? <laughs> In the in the in the first black parade bit or the second black parade bit? Because in the first black black parade bit, yeah, here. I am in shock. No, it wasn't. That was fucking floor when he said that. This has major implications on my view of Serbs. I'm so scared. Of no, you didn't spoil anything for me. I promise. I'm fully caught up. Um. One, the biggest thing as a DM that doesn't have access to any Patreons is I don't have access to DM notes. I don't have access to all of the DMs talking. And so for a second, I was like, oh. Oh no! Have they have they have they seen the episode? And I, yes, I've I've seen the episode. I've seen it. I've, I'm fully caught up. Um, for me, the biggest thing is I always feel yes. There, there. Most people spell it with an X, but I don't. It doesn't feel right to me. I like it with a Z. Um. Oh, see, I don't know. I don't know how to. Oh, wait a second. Oh, hang on. What? But no. Um, you didn't spoil anything. Uh, what, what's crazy to me is there's so many things that you feel should be planned. Like, I'm trying to decide if this would count as a spoiler or not. Uh-oh. Um, I just realized that you not having Patreon means you don't get to listen to Rock's Rock. I feel so bad for you. There is an animatic on YouTube with with the entire song of Rock's Rock. And also it's unlisted, so there's a playlist that has it in it. Like I could totally buy it off the website if I oh my gosh. Like if I really, really desperately needed to. The amount of times that I've damaged myself while listening to Rock's Rock is crazy, okay? I have fallen. Uh, I get very stimmy and very happy when I listen to Rock's Rock. And I even broke the box that I keep the paints in. When <laughs> you know all the words? That is awesome. I don't think I know all of the words. I just- everything about it just makes my brain too happy. <laughs> um... Is it- Ah. Uh... Oh, I didn't beat him enough. But yeah, because I don't have a lot of access to any of this stuff talking from DMs and stuff, uh, I get very, like, scared that I'm doing it wrong. I think I'm in the wrong place. If I stand on this edge and it points out into the sand... It does, of course it does. It always does. It could never be simple. I'm so upset I couldn't see daddies on tour. I had just gone into dungeons and daddies when, like, it was, sh I shortly got into it after they announced their tour. 
Um, and so, like, I, I started listening, like, a couple of weeks after they announced it, and so I was like, oh, that's cool, I don't really care, I probably won't get that far into this podcast, and then I get fully caught up, and I get sad, because, sure, they're gonna do another tour probably in the future, but it's not gonna be for a while. They never do it for a while. It's always it's gonna be so long before I d before they ever tour on the the West Coast again. Damn. So I yeah, I am a very new <laughs> like compared to a lot of other people. I am very new. Um. Hello, Opal. Do not- don't eat that. She's fine in here. Hang on. I have something on my floor! So do you think I feel like- How do you think I feel? Well, I'm so weird country. Hey! Hey, if Lovejoy- If Lovejoy can do an American tour- If Lovejoy- oh, If Lovejoy can do an American tour- I feel like Dungeons and Daddies will eventually make it to Europe. Because, I mean... I don't... There, you might not get all of the members... Oh! Hey! What are you doing? She may start barking. We're, we'll see. Yeah, Lovejoy. I have no clue who that is. Uh, oh... I'm so sorry, I'm so used to conversating with people who are not only on Dungeons and Daddies side of the internet, but also on like the other sides of the internet I'm on. Yes. Um they are a British uh they're <laughs> See, when I say they're a British band to Americans it, that's enough description. <laughs> but it, But if you're like used to British things, I don't think describing them as a British band very much helps. <laughs> I I do apologize for that. Uh Wilbur uh, it's not Wilbursoot's band. I have to ask the question, when I say I'm British, how do you think I sound? Let I'll see how British they are. Ah. <laughs> uh, gosh, now I have to like forget cuz I think I've seen a couple of your TikToks. And so, I think I've heard your voice. I think so. If not, I may be wrong. If not, ignore me. Um Do you fresh? I really don't want to. I don't think I can. See, <laughs> okay, there's a blooper in the audiobook episode of me just saying. British, 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 he is British because I kept messing up Farron's accent. A bull? You can't see her, but she's being very adorable. I'm trying to think up a sentence. If you need a very specific British accent for your podcast, I'm your person. I will, I will take reference if I need to. One thing that I, I want to visit the UK someday, and one of the biggest things that I'm highly certain is I'm going to, like halfway through my trip, just have a very heavy accent. I'm gonna feel so rude about it. But that's just how my brain works.
See, I'm trying, I'm trying to think. My accent isn't very good today. Like, it's taking a lot. And this isn't very good. Like, I'm struggling very badly. It's mostly with the A's. Mm. First of all, if you go to Britain, don't pronounce half like that. Like half or half? 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 Oh, that makes sense. Uh. Half? Or half? Use the R sound, not the A sound. It looks like I'm trying to, like, eat a hot dog. I'm so sorry. Oh. Posted on TikTok of me just saying half. I will appreciate that very much. I'll tag you. Oh. But. Oh, wait, hello? But it is time for the end of stream. I don't think you need the end of spiel stream stuff. Uh, Instagram, YouTube, this is the Twitch, the TikTok, all that other good stuff. I don't know. Oh, no. I'm almost done, baby. Uh, I don't know if there's anyone good to raid right now. We'll check. We'll check and see. Just kidding. I'm gonna go to sleep. That is probably a great idea. Ah, oh, Bexy, you're alive. Well, I hope you have a good sleep, G. Uh, thank you for joining stream. Friday, hopefully, it will be an amazing stream. As all streams are. Uh, have a good sleep, G. Thank you for joining. I need to get the raid set up. Goodbye. I'll say half in the morning. That is perfectly fine. Why is the ad so long? I get such long ads when I'm waiting to raid. Oh. Uh, okay. Bye bye. Wait. Yes. Bye bye. Bye-bye. 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 Bye-bye.